It's time for another video in which I'll be advising you on the best way to consume. And the subject for today is screen wash. You know, the stuff that you put in your car. What's the cheapest way to buy it? Well, what I've got here is a five litre bottle of pre-mixed screen wash. I bought it from a reputable retailer and it costs £7.49. And this is a screen wash dispensing machine. You'll find them at nearly every petrol station across the country. But is it cheaper to buy your screen wash from a shop or from one of these machines? Most of us would think that these machines are a complete rip-off, and that's fair. But to find out if that's the case, I've gathered samples from a variety of different petrol stations. So we're going to see what you actually get from these screen wash dispensing machines and also compare it to what you get from the shop. So let's begin. To start with, we're going to look at some of the supermarkets and what screen wash we get from their machines. Let's start with Tesco, and this is what we got. It costs £1.50, the machine runs for 90 seconds, and you get 2.2 litres. Next up is Asda, and this is what you get. It costs £2, the machine runs for 80 seconds, and you get 3 litres. And finally for the supermarkets is Sainsbury's, this is what we got. It costs £1, and unlike the others, they don't say that the machine will run for a certain amount of time. They just say it's £1 for 2 litres, but in this case we got 3.3 litres for a pound. So how do the supermarket petrol station machines compare to the shop or screen wash? Well, at first glance, we've got less screen wash, but don't forget, we also paid less money. The important thing here is how much it costs per litre. And our shop bought screen wash costs £1.50 a litre, so that's going to act as our sort of benchmark. Tesco costs 68 pence per litre. Asda costs 67 pence per litre. And here's where things get interesting. Sainsbury's costs 30 pence per litre. I'm going to move these out of the way and then we can have a look at the main branded petrol stations and see how they compare. Okay, main brand petrol stations then. This is probably where you'd expect the biggest rip-offs to occur. As we've seen with the supermarkets, that may not actually be the case, but let's see how the others do. Starting with Esso, and we've got a bit of a problem. Here's the sample from Esso and it's very empty. I went to five different Esso petrol stations and none of them had a screen wash machine. In fact, none of them had a water tap. So I don't know what they're doing there, but maybe it's just not a thing for Esso. So we're gonna have to disqualify them and move on. Let's see the results for Shell then. And their machine cost £1.50 and ran for 60 seconds, but it gave us four litres of screen wash. And lastly, BP, the most expensive at three pounds, their machine ran for 80 seconds but I got over five liters of screen wash. In fact, I had to stop putting it in the bottle because it was just gonna overflow and make a mess everywhere. So quite a quantity for three quid. But of course, that only tells us one side of the story. The important thing here is how much it costs per litre. So how do these compare to our benchmark of £1.50 a litre? Well, Esso, f*** all, they're disqualified. Shell comes in at 38 pence per litre, which is pretty decent, and BP is 60 pence per litre. I'm going to move things around a little bit here and then we can review the data to see what we've learned. So here's all of our screen washes and I've arranged them in order of most expensive down to the cheapest based on how much it would cost for five litres of each screen wash. Of course, each machine is dispensing different quantities, but since we know how much it costs per litre, we can calculate how much it costs for five, giving us a much more direct comparison with the shop bought screen wash. So what are the results then? Well, in last place is the shop bought screen wash at £7.49 for five litres. In fifth place is Tesco's with £3.40. In fourth place is Asda's with £3.35. In third place is BP at £3. In second place is Shell at £1.90. And coming in at first with an absolute bargain price of £1.50 for five litres of screen wash is Sainsbury's. An interesting result because what that shows is pretty much in every scenario you're better off going to a machine than you are a shop. So what's the conclusion then? Well, I went into this thinking those petrol station screen wash machines would be an absolute rip-off, but our results show that that's not necessarily the case. And indeed, the shop-bought stuff is actually one of the more expensive options. Of course, results may vary from place to place, but based on the results that we've got here, we can say that Sainsbury's is the cheapest option, so that's probably your best bet. Tesco's and the shop-bought stuff probably want to avoid those. Other than price, our results have also shown that there's quite a variety when it comes to the dilution ratio of screen wash in each of the machines. For example, Shell's looks like water. It does have detergent in it, I've checked, but it's clearly a very weak solution, whereas BP's is very strong. And of course, the shop bought has probably got the strongest concentration of screen wash in it. So I've reordered things to reflect what I think is the strongest screen wash down to the weakest screen wash based on absolutely nothing other than what they look like. In first place is the shop bought screen wash. Second place is BP's. BP, third place is Tesco's, in fourth place is Sainsbury's, fifth place Asda, and then in last place, as we established, is Shell. It really isn't the best. 
And there we are. Hopefully you're now in a far better position to make an informed choice or decision when it comes to your screen wash purchases. And who knew the petrol station screen wash machines weren't quite the ripoff that we thought they were. Thanks for watching.